fishing, just fishing, fishing, just fishing. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, chicken jerks, fish. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, just fishing. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, chicken jerks, fish. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, just fishing. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, chicken jerks, fish. All right, everybody. Good morning. It's a little after 4.30, Sunday, June 17th, here with Doc. Good morning. We are going to try for stripers. We'd be on the road already, if you will, if uh, somebody was here. Who's missing? John Sweeney. Sweeney is missing. Waiting on him. Um, we're going to fish for a couple of hours for stripers at First Light here in the Long Island Sound. Let you know how we do. Good morning. And here we go. We finally got Sweeney. And we're off. Breaking Matatuck so, Inlet now. Are you, are you rolling, John? Yeah. Still can't See? add lib? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. I mean, you know, it's our first trip, so we don't really know if they're here or not, but we're, we're gonna, you know, we're going to try at least. Okay, guys, here we go. Uh, this was a Father's Day, June 17, early morning, striper run on the Long Island Sound. Uh, here's a quick shot of Doc's boat running. You can see we're going 51 miles an hour trying to get to the spot that Doc has, um, you know, before the sun really came out. Um, we were going to use eels and tsunami slow pitch rods, seven ounce rods. I believe we all have Maxell. 20s on them a very light setup very light rod but has a really good strong backbone uh great fishing trip you know uh we got into fish pretty quick um i was very fortunate to get three nice keepers uh we kept one for doc uh, the rest were released doc had a short sweeney got the golden donut as we were joking with him the whole time uh, unfortunate for him he he did hook up to a nice fish but uh didn't stay on the line uh, and all in all, a, a, a great trip. Uh, hope you enjoy. Ooh, just got hit. You did? Yeah. Yep. There you go. There you go. There That's you a go. fish. Nice. That's a fish. Nice, dude. Make it out of your way. You see how the mark is? Yeah, done? yeah, yeah. That's a, there you go, baby. And you'll see my technique there. It, it's called the bow to the cow technique. Hopefully you're all aware of it. What I basically did is once I felt the hit, I, I gave him a couple seconds, uh, let him hit me, uh, started running with it. And I, I keep my rod tip, and you'll see in the video, really high. And that'll give me a few feet to actually drop the rod down and, uh, you know, really set the hook hard. You can see it was a hard hook set. And despite this pole being so light, it has a really strong backbone and lets you really stick the fish. Uh, we're fishing a, a, a small piece that Doc knows about in the in the Long Island Sound. Uh, it, it, it's a 35 to 40 foot uh, a boulder bed, I guess. Uh, we it's not sticky. We don't get hung up, but it certainly uh, had fish. And uh, we you know we fish both sides of the slope, coming up and then on the way down. Nice one too. Oh yeah. oh yeah, really good one. All right, let him. He's still got life. Yeah, watch the engines. Let him run. Okay, we're gonna go right back over that spot. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't want to come up. Yeah. Yeah, that rod's great. Wow. What a rod. You got time, we're at a I know. Bring him in, Johnny. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, that's a good that fish. Is. Yeah, nice fish. I'm sorry, no, Sweeney. No, no, no. Right. Yeah, Sweeney, just let him go down next guys. time, but good job. Well, it, it wasn't go. running. And Johnny, you know what? Ooh. Wow, and the hook came out. out. Mm -hmm. The hook. Yeah straight up is the hook out like, oh, oh the really? hook slid through like oh i didn't yeah notice. always like yeah. that oh, that's i never even thought yeah. of that shit that's a nice, <laughs> nice fish yeah. dude great oh job oh my goodness awesome that's a great fish that's a real nice fish Damn. wow that's a nice good fish. morning sir oh yes i love this so doc reset the drift and uh, literally on the same eel next drift 
I got very lucky and got another fish. I'm just glad I'm not going to get a donut today. <laughs> look at the worried look on your face. Oh, I'm not worried. Yeah, you are. You're I don't thinking. Care. I mean, I'm, you're I thinking. Just want us to catch one striper at least. You're gonna call me crispy cream today. Out of you. He wanted to go to the gut. I can pull a of my And you hear these guys razzing me about wanting to go to the gut, and what I mean by gut is Plum Gut, uh, a spot way further east than here. Um, it's, it's a spot I know very well. It's one of my go-to spots for stripers. It's a sticky spot. You need a lot of weight. Um, it's not as peaceful and relaxing as this. You're also dealing with huge reps. So it was a, a good move, um, listening to Doc and coming here. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, I'll be switching. Oh yeah. Let's, John, let's go to the gut. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, Shut up. Let's go to the gut. Actually, you should okay. let him go to the gut. <laughs> you should bring you to the spots. The doc can't drive. The doc is a stationary object. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Yeah, huh? Yeah, this guy Wait. Keep that rod tip. Yep, back. I know. So I know. I know this is 30 pound test. Yeah. <laughs> but I tell you, you're right. This this rod is insane. It weighs nothing. And it 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 it's the load. That's the beauty of it. Yeah. Like said, am I on my track? Am I directly on the track or what? Yeah, you are. <laughs> I caught him early though, but I think it's wow. a bigger fish than that's the last fish, one. Boys. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I want, we wanted to keep a smaller fish. We don't want to keep the big fish. And before anybody asks, we are not being paid by Tsunami. We have no affiliation with Tsunami. Uh, we fished with Skinner one day last year. That video is up on his site where he was using that rod and it was amazing. And, uh, you know, we all have one now, uh, same setup. And it, it's just a fantastic rod for this setup. Sweeney, you're going to have to switch with me and maybe grab the net too. Yeah, no, I'm, ah, he's, he, there he is. See the swirl? Uh, you're gonna have to migrate back here. I am, I am. I know. <laughs> Let me get... Doc, my line is still in. In yeah. case you end up oh, pulling everything up, you're gonna have to go forward. Yeah. So I'm in front of you. All right, cool. Boy, he ran like a banshee. I want to take a snapshot of it. All right, let me bring him to you. Actually, smaller than. Hold on. Good job. Yep, like that. Is that smaller? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it is smaller. It's fat though. <laughs> yeah. Ah, and he took my eel. Hold on, the, the fish needs to be revived. Hold on, hold on. Ah. Oh, there he goes. More marks uh, right now. Big marks right behind where we are right now. We'll be there in 20 seconds. Nice mark. Five, four, three, two, one. Set. Nice count. There you go. There you go. See what happens when you listen? Box. Hey, great countdown, by the way. That was perfect. <laughs> right? right you, let me get you the net. I'll bring up. Not a big fish, bud. Yeah. No? I don't think so. No. It's a swinger? That's a, that's a different rod, right? It's up already. Wow. Yeah, you want me to hold your line? Yeah. I'll... I'll uh, should I net it or just grab it by the mouth? It's a small fish. Yeah, it's Blue? A, it's a, no. You sure? Yeah. It's, it's a schoolie. A little schoolie? Yeah. yeah. yeah I got perfect. it. Beautiful. Um, not, even, not a keeper. Is that textbook or what? Yeah, that was textbook, dude. That's the way you do it. Yeah, look, look, <laughs> where, look where the hook is. Oh, yeah. 
Mm -hmm. uh, I, I got the, let me get the instrument. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was actually extra bowing on that. Hold yeah, on, you didn't have... Oh, look cool. at all the sea lice. Yeah. Doc will take this up. We got to bring them up. I yeah. Guess and there's no rod holder to put do one down. down. <laughs> Doc, guide the line. This guy's filled with lice, there's man. Nice marks there. We got to do that drift again. Do it again. Damn, son. I'll get the, uh, that blue instrument perfect. Oh, he's doing that? You're getting the blue? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that, that's easy. All right, little guy. There he goes. Wow. The little guys are so easy. They yeah. just Did you have the thing on? I might change my eel up, Doc. The seal yeah, is... I mean, I'm not going to throw it away, but it's it's like spinning in itself. It's It's got no life left. And you heard me say there that I was going to change out my eel. And look, we, we had a lot of eels with us, all alive, frisky. I had this one on for a while, no action on it. And it, it was just spinning in itself. It was, uh, to borrow a line from the Princess Bride, mostly dead. Um, and uh, it wound up paying dividends because I switched the eel, we reset, and I uh, hooked up to our last keeper. What just came up? It's a freaking seal right there. Where? You see the circle? Yeah. Oh, what was that? Where? Was, where? Was it big? Uh, Wolvers, whatever the hell they are. Where? Over there? It, it should come up again. No, forget it now. Um, I don't know. You see the, the two? I saw see it. The, you see Coming the, up uh, on a Whoa. Oh, Here yeah. we go. Oh, oh, right go. Wow. Now we just wow. have to hope that seal That's doesn't take it. <laughs> wow. Wow, John. That, yeah, no, this is... Nowhere near the size of the other ones. No, I'm not. Oh, maybe it is. Maybe the seal got it. <laughs> ah, it's not that good. Still in good water, Sweeney. Good. Could this be the third keeper, Doc? Was mine a keeper? No. Yes, it was. <laughs> hey, Doc, if 18 inches is a keeper, maybe if it was a fluke. This could be a keeper. That might be a nice fish, dude. Nah, it's, it, it, trust me. No? No, I picked up two that, that yeah. fought much harder than this. Okay. He's a keeper. Well, I'm just seeing the run. Yeah. Ooh, John, he might be a keeper. All right. Well, he's getting released anyway. You got your fish in the box. I haven't seen him yet. Pump the rod. Oh, it's a good fish, John. That's oh, wow. It fish. is a good fish. Good Thank fish. you, Doc. Nice fish, dude. Wow. Well, it's okay. That's I got him. I got fish. him. Yeah, it is a good fish. Look at that. And I changed eels. I had yeah, like a, yeah, I had an eel yeah. on for a while and it wasn't frisky and yeah. it was spinning and. Yeah. Yeah. Don't bring it up. Let's go back. That's four fish, baby. He was not hooked good at all. <laughs> good thing we kept pressure. Yeah. Definitely a keeper. That's fish. Wait, yeah. let me, can I take a picture with no, it? No, no, we took. I'm going to just send it to my friends. You want to take a picture yeah. of my fish? Yes. It's my boat. All right. <laughs> Wait, the sun is there? Yeah. Yeah. I got to dry my hands. Just put it up there so I can dry my hands off. Yeah. Then we got to release him while he's still alive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, grab him by the mouth. Oh. Don't grab him by the gills, please. Yeah. I just want to send it to them and let them know that we can't. Hold on, let me take one this way too. Oh, that's a good picture. Okay. Let me get... Actually, his fins are up. He'll, he's gonna yeah, go. yeah, he's going to go. Yeah. Ooh. yeah, I mean, we don't we don't uh, have him out of the water long enough. He's to... young enough to pop too. Yeah. Where did the red go? I got it, sorry. Thank you again, everybody, for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And remember, if you do like these videos, hit Just that like fishing. button and hit that subscribe button. Fishing. Just fishing. 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 Just fishing.